Bringing up Bates fans are loving Evan Stewart's latest post about his toddler daughter, Layla. He revealed that his little troublemaker made a huge mess in the kitchen recently. Of course, fans love seeing whatever Carlin Bates and her husband even decide to share on social media. They especially love all of the updates about their daughter. Layla is a year and a half old and will turn two on January 31. Layla Stewart gets herself into trouble. In a new Instagram reel, Avon shows fans just how quickly his daughter is growing up. The little one is already getting into lots of trouble. The short video features Layla sitting in a pile of flour on the kitchen floor. Then, Carlin and Evan walk into the kitchen and pretend to be shocked. When Evan made the video, he used a song that's instrumental for a few seconds. Then, when the singer says, run, Carlin and Evan dash from the scene. Obviously, neither of them wants to clean up a big mess like this. In his caption, Evan asks, Who would be cleaning this mess up in your home, mom or dad? It looks like Carlin and Evan set up this scene themselves to make the video. Bringing up Bates fans hope the couple didn't leave the toddler unattended so long that she was able to create such a big mess. Of course, toddlers are quick and can get into trouble in a matter of seconds. Bringing up Bates fans think Evan's new post is hilarious. Naturally, fans are loving this new post from Evan. They think it's adorable and funny that Layla is getting herself into trouble. Other fans are sharing their own experiences with their toddlers getting into trouble too. In response to Evan's question about who would clean up this mess, fans are saying that both parents would have to help out. One could bathe the baby while the other cleans up the kitchen. Carlin reveals that she ended up having to take care of this mess, writing, For the record, I cleaned this one. Several of Evan and Carlin's family members chimed in to comment on the cute reel, saying how cute and hilarious little Layla is. So, can you believe Layla Stewart made such a big mess? What do you think of Evan's video? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. For more news about the Bringing Up Bates family, check back with TV shows Ace. The Bringing Up Bates family has grown again. Josie Bates and Kelton Balka introduced their newest family member to the world on Tuesday, June 15. In an exclusive interview with Us Weekly, the proud parent said, After so many months of dreaming about what it would be like as a family of four and anticipating our baby's arrival, Kelton and I are absolutely thrilled to welcome our little baby girl, Hazel Sloan Balka, into the world. This pregnancy was much more complex than our first due to complications we had from a previous miscarriage in August 2020, so we were a little nervous, but delivery went so smoothly thanks to Dr. Brabson's incredible birthing team, our midwife, Laura, and the kind nurses at Tenova North Birthing Center. We are so thankful and relieved to have our precious baby girl healthy and here in our arms. The tiny little one weighed in at 6 pounds, 3 ounces, she's 18 inches long. The family is soaking up these moments with their new daughter. They said they are enjoying every second of cuddling and bonding. They added, God has answered so many of our prayers throughout this journey and it was such a tender and emotional experience to finally meet her and hold her. Soon, Hazel will get to go home and meet her big sister Willow, who turns two in July. Josie looks forward to seeing the sisters grow up together. She is very close with some of her sisters too, so she knows how special that bond can be. At the time of publishing, Josie and Kelton had yet to announce their baby's arrival on social media they will likely share more photos of her soon. Another bringing up Bates' baby on the way. As we reported last week, Whitney and Zach Bates' fourth child, a son named Jad and Carl, arrived shortly before Hazel. Tori and Bobby Smith's third child, a baby girl named Charlotte, will arrive sometime this month too. Those are the only pregnant Bates women right now, but it's only a matter of time before another little one is on the way. For now, fans should be on baby watch for Tori's daughter. So, are you excited for the Bringing Up Bates family? What do you think of the new little one's name?
Let us know in the comments below. For more updates about the Bates family, check back with TV shows Ace. Bringing up Bates star Lawson Bates is all about helping others, and he's always looking for another opportunity to make a difference. He's currently in Haiti, as we previously reported. Fans may know that the Bates and Duggar kids are a part of Medic Corps, which is a non-profit organization. Medic Corps steps up when natural disasters hit. So, when an earthquake hit Haiti on August 14, several of the Duggar and Bates sons went to help out with the rest of the Medic Corps team. Since they've been hard at work, the kids haven't posted on social media, but the Medic Corps Instagram page has been sharing updates. Now, Lawson finally had a chance to share an update with his social media followers. Lawson Bates pitches in to help. In a new Instagram post, Lawson gives his social media followers an update. He shared a series of photos and videos from his time in Haiti. In his caption, he wrote, We've had a rescue team on the ground and in the air in Haiti for the past week, helping facilitate emergency medical evacuations for hundreds of critical victims. On 8-14, a magnitude 7.2 earthquake shook the country killing 1,400-plus people and injuring thousands more. He added, The pain and devastation is absolutely heartbreaking. Many precious people are still in desperate need of urgent help. Basic necessities, such as food, water, and shelter, are also becoming a huge issue. At the end of his post, Lawson said that there is still more work to be done by the rescue groups involved. He also gave fans the opportunity to donate on the Medic Corps website. Bringing up Bates fans are thanking Lawson for this update and for all of the hard work he's doing to help out. Lawson's mom, Kelly Jo Bates, writes, I couldn't be more proud of y'all. My heart aches for these poor families. Thank y'all for your ministry there. Lawson's other followers and family members are leaving similar comments and sending encouraging words to him. Hopefully, Lawson will share another post soon when he has the chance. For now, he's focusing on the people who need his help. So, what do you think of Lawson Bates' latest post? Have you been keeping up with the Duggars and Bates while they're in Haiti? Let us know in the comments below. For more news about the Bates family, check back with TV shows Ace.